I offered myself to bring you all this information for the consumption of this house. Last week, on Thursday 4th November 2021, the Ntungamo Municipality Member of Parliament, Yona Musingozi, alerted Parliament of allegations that over 50 billion shillings have been misallocated under the directorship of Minister for Science and Technology in the office of the President, Dr. Monica Museneru. The Deputy Speaker of Parliament, Anita Among, asked MP Musinguzi to present his allegations with facts before the August House could take his cries serious. Before the clouds gathered, the NRM leader representing the people of Tungamo Municipality, Yona Musinguzi, during the Tuesday parliamentary session, presented several documents as evidence backing up his claims. MP Yona Musinguzi asserts that the Minister for Science and Technology, Monica Musenero, led a team of scientists to the President and acquired funds to the tunes of over 50 billion shillings to fast-track manufacturing of COVID-19 vaccines in Uganda under the Presidential Scientific Initiative for Epidemics. When you ask her the procedures she followed in channeling the 31 billion to different doctors, she cannot tell you the procedure she followed. She had picked a few of them. Even those whom she had picked, some of them have denied her. I lay on you table. You documents, and that is the evidence we asked for. And that's what is laying on table. The chairperson of the Parliamentary Committee on Science, Technology and Innovations, Achia Remigio, also MP for Pian County, tried to block his comrade Yona Musinguzi presentation, saying the committee he chairs is already handling the matter. However, his information was not digested. And the report of preside is precisely Order, before Madam me. Speaker. The information I'm giving Madam Speaker is that this piece of information... Order, Madam Speaker. Let's get all the documents. That, help, that will help the minister. Parliament also blocked the Minister of State for Finance, General Duties, Henry Musasizi, from responding to the concerns on behalf of Dr. Monica Musenero. Deputy Speaker Anita Among, who chaired the plenary sitting, resolved to have a select committee to investigate the matter. Those in favor say select aye. committee. And the contrary, no. Uh. I keep this one for myself. But for my security, Madam Speaker, on Thursday, two vehicles followed me. And I know you have enough security. I will not move out of this parliament before you give me one security. Daniel Mugoya and Gloria Gutabinji. Thank you. ABC News. Member.